Okay, so I already made a short about this, but I wanted to make a more long form video. This is a 2006 Nissan Titan, and I'm looking to replace these factory non-tow package mirrors with mirrors from the tow package. As you can see on the passenger side, it is possible, so I'll show you how to do that right now. Before we get started, I should mention this is a 2006 XE crew cab. This is pretty base model aside from, I think, one like premium package. Uh, that's why I have the sliding rear window, but I do not have power side mirrors. So no matter what mirrors I put on, they're manual adjustment. Your mileage is going to vary on this. I don't know if the connectors for the non-tow package and the tow package mirrors are the same. I would definitely go to like titantalk.com and join the forum if you have more in-depth questions, but I just wanted to make a quick video uh, to show the, the general idea of what to do. So for me, I don't have to worry about the wiring. I can just tuck the wiring harness down into the door and let it hang because I have no controls for it anyways. I might wire that in later, but that's a completely different video. Okay, so first thing you're gonna do to remove your original mirrors is peel off this plastic piece. It's gonna reveal four studs, each with a 10 mil nut on it. I've removed three of them already. There's one left. Make sure your mirror doesn't fall when you take the last nut off because uh, you don't want to break it just in case you want to go back to factory. These are the four studs right here that we removed the nuts from when we took this mirror off. Right here is the tow mirror. Uh, it's going to be the same orientation in terms of the holes it goes through, but it's slightly different. So there's one stud with a 10 mil. You're going to put that on first. You then put this plate on the inside of the door. And this is like a, a bracket that actually is going to hold on the mirror. From there, there's three of these long bolts. Uh, these are T25, so Torx 25. Uh, make sure you have that bit on hand before you try to pull a set of tow mirrors from the junkyard or before you uh, try to put this on. Of course, uh, if you want, you could always just find another bolt with this same thread pitch if you just had the mirrors and not not the bolts but it's probably easier just to get some factory bolts um i don't know exactly what the bolt pattern is on here but it looks like maybe an m8 i'm not sure when you're done it's going to look something like this i know it looks ugly up here where that uh, plastic piece was originally but you don't see any of this when the door is closed so again there's a 10 mil nut under this make sure you tighten that properly before you put this plate on unlike what i did the first time so Tighten up that 10 mil nut that'll hold the mirror on. You then put these in with your Torx 25 with this plate under it, and you should be good to go. Again, I don't have wiring to deal with, so I stuffed it in the hole that's there into the door, and it just dangles there. Once you're done that, last thing to do is spray some WD-40 or liquid wrench in here. This is going to make it a lot easier for you to slide in and out this mirror by hand when you need to. 